three full size products this time and over three times the what we paid in value. This is a really great box. Come and check it out with me. Hi guys, hope you guys are having a wonderful day today. Today we're getting into the Bella box for the month of June. Right, where's we get which month it is? So Bella Box is an Australian New Zealand subscription box. It's $22.95 per month to subscribe. Um, as far as I can tell, they've taken away the longer memberships. You can only do month by month at the moment. So yeah, and my 12 month is running out, so now we're doing month by month. So Bella Box has a bunch of different samples in it generally. Sometimes they have a couple of full sizes, sometimes it's just samples. Generally you get to do an opt-in, but they've stopped doing that the last few months. So I'm not sure if they've just gotten rid of that as a plan. But yeah, let's see what we got in this month. Looks like we've got a couple of decent sized products in here. Let's go through and see what we've got. Something I'm very excited about. First up, we've got some nail polish. So this is from Essie and this is in the shade 312. It doesn't seem to have a shade. Oh, Spin the Bottle it's called. I quite like this shade. It's very kind of neutral. Let's see, let's give it a try and see how we go. I believe Essie nail polishes are supposed to be quite good as well. And it's a really lovely neutral shade. It just kind of complements your fingers without showing up too much. Like very at workable. Yeah, very nice. It went on nicely. We'll see how it dries. I probably shouldn't have done it first up, but you know, <laughs> mistakes are always made. But yeah, looks very nice. I'll have to do the rest of them later. Next up, we've got something with a bit of settling on it. <laughs> Give it a bit of a shake. So this is, oh, this is from Lush. Lush is a really lovely bathroom, bath bombs and bath shower gels and stuff like that. And this is the Olive Branch Shower Gel. Full of sweeping citrus notes and gentle reassuring well warmth. Not wealth. Mmm, that smells really good. It smells like nail polish. <laughs> Let me try with this hand. Mmm, that does smell really good, really citrusy. I've just run out of shower gel, so this is perfect timing. We've got another full-size thing in here. Looks like we've got a mascara from Model Co. Very pink. <laughs> so it's a black mascara on the inside though. Would be awesome if it was a pink mascara. I would love to have pink eyelashes. I like black, but it's just a bit boring. I like fancy fun colors sometimes too. Ooh, I really like this wand. It's kind of fluffy and fat. I have a, I think it's Revolution, um, mascara wand that is almost run out that has a wand like this. So I might try this one and see. I use generally two mascaras at once. I use like one to lengthen them and then one to add volume. So this looks like a volumizing one. Doesn't tell me on there what it promises, but it look, the wand looks volumizing. And then we've just got a couple of little samples. So first up we've got a sample from Trilogy. It's a vitamin C microdermabrasion with five blend AHAs and pumice. That sounds amazing. So AHAs are really good for evening your skin tone and um, like a chemical exfoliant. Apply to clean damp skin and leave for approximately three minutes. Gently massage then thoroughly rinse off. So you have to leave it on quite a long time to get it to work. Ooh. Smells kind of citrusy. I'm going to open it up because I'm really interested to see how exfoliated it is. Mm, smells good. Also like nail polish. <laughs> it smells good. Oh, that's very scrubby. Yeah, that feels nice. Very particulate. Feels like little grains of sand or little bits of salt maybe. But a very gentle scrub. So if you're after a nice gentle exfoliant, this might be the one for you. Oh, my skin feels absolutely smooth and beautiful underneath. I hope my face feels like that. That's lovely. That might have to be a repurchase. That one's really nice. And then we've got, oh, something where the lids come off. That's not good. Lucky none of it's spread out everywhere. Uh, we've got a little Cetaphil moisturizing cream. Hydrates for 48 hours and fully restores the skin moisture barrier. Dry to very dry sensitive skin. So that sounds perfect for me. Sweet almond oil and vitamins E and B3 and pro vitamin B5 to clinically proven to nourish skin in just one day and help repair skin's natural moisture bar barrier in one week for immediate and long lasting relief. So for your face and body, fantastic. This will be nice over my nicely exfoliated hand. Oh, very thick. Yeah, spreads out really nicely and, moist and absorbs in really good as well. Just a standard moisturizing smell. It feels really lovely on my hand. Yeah, that's nice. I think Cetaphil is quite a nice brand. They, I used that one when my kids were little. Just a nice supermarket brand if you're after a nice moisturizer from supermarket. Yeah, that's lovely. And then last thing I think is a 
Cetaphil, another Cetaphil product, uh, Optimal Hydration 48 Hour Activation Serum. Instantly absorbs to deeply replenish skin's hydration for 48 hours. So it's got some hyaluronic acid in it, that's good. So I might give this one and this one a try for, you know, I think this one's four mils, so maybe one try, maybe two. But once they're open, they're hard to keep preserved. But it'd be nice to try those ones together and see if they work nicely together. And then we've just got some random sales pitch. Cool, so let me get you guys some prices. So the nail polish is a full size product and this is $15.99, which I think is probably a reasonable price for nail polish. Uh, the mascara was also a full size and it was $25. Model Co are a bit hit and miss, so I have to give it a go and see whether or not I like it. But some Model Co products are really good and some are not so good. But yeah, $25. The Shower wash is also a full size, so even though it's tiny, it's 100 grams. And this is $11. Cetaphil moisturizer, 100 grams. Um, 100 grams is $11.49 at the shops, so this is worth about $1.60. The microderm abrasion, 60 mils is $32.50, so this is worth about $5.40. It's really nice though, it seems really lovely. And then the serum, 30 mils of the serum is $39, so this is worth about $5 as well. So that's Expensive sample serums are really expensive. I mean, I really love serums though So like I use them like multiple every day and they're really lovely. So probably worth it Like it's not the most expensive serum I've seen but <laughs> it's quite expensive um, So that brings the total value of my box to about $64 So three times what we paid that's pretty good value for money I think and like three full-size products is really good for Bella box and I'm happy with the sample sizes as well like this seems really lovely the microdermabrasion stuff and these actually the moisturizer feels really lovely as well and I love different moisturizers for my face. I love trying different ones. So yeah, I'm really happy with this Bella box. I think this was a really good month. Last month was not so good and it tends to be like one month is really good and one month isn't. So yeah, this month is really good. Not looking forward to next month. <laughs> but yeah, please let me know what you guys thought about this box as well. I love knowing you guys' opinions. If you're new around here, please subscribe while you're here. It means absolute world to me when you guys subscribe. I'll leave a link here for the box they had last month if you wanted to check out last month's box and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!